How did I... That's quite a spoiler. How did I hear and today we're going to play Perfect Apocalypse If Universe Imperfect Fortopia Chapter 5. It's finally come out and pretty interesting that we are seeing here so far. That silhouette, that's definitely Fault, isn't it? Who else but Fault? Anyway, interesting what probably we're going to see here with the soldier looking like that. And a cross. Oh yes, you are a god. I call it apparently. Yeah. So yeah, let's start playing the game, shall we? I don't know what else to say. Calling from my soul. The, the fucking illustrated part looks... Yeah, look, look, CG. What is this? What is this good? What is this? Interesting. Calling from my soul. Let's start, shall we? We barely escaped this, to these places a few days ago. But we had no place to go. Now I destroyed it with my own hands. Do you have any hope left? Who are you? If there's still any left, I'll bring it back. Even if it cost me everything. Chapter 5, Calling from His Soul. The color is... Interesting. Red, yellow. Yellow? Cyan and blue. Or maybe green. Oh. Oh! <laughs> it's the four of you. <laughs> Well, that was pretty quick. So, red, cyan, who's yellow? There's like blue, but no yellow. Oh, V is yellow. Okay then. Then who is blue? Uh huh. No. Maybe you should drink some water, Nola chan. Now sit suddenly hugging her knees with dead eyes. I'm sorry, Nao Chan. I wish I could have done something to you. We just have to endure it for now. Hey. You should stop sulking already. How long are you going to be like that? Uh huh. But the tragedy started two weeks before that. If I had used magic, those people. Oh. Max grabbed Noel by the collar and pushed her against the wall with a fierce expression. <laughs> Max, are you okay? <laughs> this is not the way, Max. This is not the way to do it. Ma Max? Ouch. How long are you going to be a crybaby? What's the point of killing them right now? That... That... Sorry, my throat is... I don't know, my throat feels very weird right now. Maybe I should drink something. BRB. Okay, I think I'm feeling better now. Let's continue. That... That... If you want to survive, stop whining. What the fuck? Imagine you're a therapist. Imagine you go to a therapist and they just start slamming you into the fucking wall because you, you're you fucking depressed, dude. <laughs> Max! That's enough. Fuck. Max opened the door with anger and went out to onto the platform. I almost crossed the line. Uh-huh. Ify. Ah, Chan, I'm sorry for this instead. That boy lost his parents because of drugs and has nowhere to go. <laughs> what? Sorry. <laughs> you know, with the fucking... Yeah, like... It's it's just so silly, like, you see the character looks like this and then you suddenly got... Yeah, they lost their parents because of drugs. <laughs> I found him in the slums where he was doing gang things to survive. That's why he doesn't know any other way to leave. I'm sorry, Charlie. I'm going to get some fresh air outside. Nora slipped through three of them and left the hallway. Hey, wait! The air outside is the same as subway, so it's not going to change. The scenery at least. Uh huh. Oh ho ho ho! Hey, what do you think you're doing? You, you got information you wanted. So? 
Oh? There's no reason to do that. What did you say? You got my cooperation? Did I ask you to do that? Hmm? You, you son of a... Before the uncle could finish his sentence, the gunshot rang out. Woo! Yippee! Finally. How ugly. Actually, one thing that you did really good. Thank you very much. Except for the fact that it's uh, actually a <laughs> pacifist, pacifistic state right now. But other than that, uh, that's a good thing. Except the fascistic regime and... But fascism? Yeah. Fascism. I, I don't know how to say it in English. Okay. <laughs> Our creator does not want you. Oh, well. At the moment, no and the later lock eyes. Oh, look what we have here. Good morning, Noel Arenberg. How are you feeling? Noel guard the leader in silence. It seems like you didn't sleep well, did you? Well, you're just a kid who can do anything without any help. So be careful with your actions. The soldiers went to the cafe. Ah, yes, and the got there around to praise her. Me, after shooting someone, time to go grab some coffee. Uh, what I was about to say is that... Is that... Yeah, uh, the... Tomoka Uncle dead? Good. Pacific regime? Bad. Sit this situation? Bad. Tomoka Uncle died? Good. Because, you know, he's a fucking son of a asshole. I have to find Max. So, no. Let's go. Max, where are you? Um... Stop. Don't involve us any further. You understand what I'm saying, right? Uh, okay. Now look down with a depressed face. You are still a friend, and I feel sorry for your illness. But what he did was fatal to everyone here. I hate to say it, but this is your responsibility. If you want to redeem yourself, show it through actions, not words. Y yes, I I understand. Good, as long as you understand. I hope you don't misunderstand. I don't want to have to kick you out of here if I can help it. You're fine if you can stand up to the drug addict whose head is already blown up. I hope you can take over from JD and get used to supporting everyone. It's still so hilarious, dude. Good luck. Thank you. After smiling, Alice turned her back as if to pretend she was in the wall. I have to do my best. Yeah. Yes, let's go. Um, sorry, but don't talk to me anymore. I don't want to be a suspect of being a traitor or something. Unlike you, I don't have the power to fight them. Please. I understand. Hmm. Iris is giving her a call to Maxa. Um, um, wait. Mm -hmm. Sorry, I don't really feel like talking right now. Uh, okay. It's not that I hate you or anything, but, you know. Wink, wink, guns, bullets. It's okay, I understand. I'm really sorry, but I'm not ready to fight yet. I wish I was as strong as you and Charlie. I'm not as strong either. No, I think you're strong. I couldn't do anything when Adrian and Nero were killed. Oh. <laughs> they get killed off screen, that's so hilar that's hilarious. Haha. <laughs> hmm. If only if only I was stronger. Don't worry, everyone knows you did your best. I can say that loud, but in, if you're in trouble, tell me right away. I'll do anything we can, we can do help. I'm really sorry, I... I... Don't cry. Just take it easy for now, okay? Um... Min held, held up a finger in front of her mouth. I'm sorry. You're not to blame. It's okay, we're on your side. Uh, 
Okay. Men look anxious. Um, very close to them, so keep your voice down. Oh, okay. You know where Max is? No, but I saw him walking towards the kiosk earlier. I don't think he went outside, but you might want to hurry. I understand. Thank you. He seems more on edge than usual. Is something wrong? If you don't want to talk about it, I won't ask any further. I am sorry. Noel, I don't think everything that happened yesterday was your fault. But if I had to point out one thing, you are a little too carefree. If that's what you're upset about, you should apologize right away. I... I'm sorry. Um... I'd rather you didn't talk to me anymore. I'm sorry, but... but what should I have done? Sorry, but I didn't... Sorry, but I don't know that either. Just don't do anything right now. Raul is glaring at Noel. Noel tried to pick inside the cafe. Uh huh. Suspicious behavior is prohibited. Even being inside? Orders are absolute. Why can't I? I don't have it to answer. That's that's so mean. They sh they kill people. What do you mean that's so mean? You're a soldier protecting the country. Why would you? The soldier pointed his gun at Noel, cutting off her words. I won't warn you twice. If you act suspiciously again, I'll el eliminate you. The soldier and Noel are glaring at each other. The other survivors are watching with bated breath. I... I understand. Noel took a step back. The soldier suddenly lowered his gun and returned to the cafe. The other survivor who witnessed this also looked away. Something's not right. Jade is gone, but I can feel the presence of an angel all around me. And they seem to have no will of their own. Interesting. Not trying to find out what's going on in the cafe. No. You're trying to pick again even after what happened? Do you really want to die? I have a responsibility to fulfill. It's great that you're so passionate about justice, but don't drag us into it. Depending on what you do, we might get caught in the crossfire. I... I know what you are thinking and how you are feeling, but you should calm down a bit. If you don't resist, you can at least stay alive. Do I still need to explain this to you, hmm? No, I understand that well. Good. I need to calm down a bit more. The servers on the other side of the door are moving around frantically. Is there anything left? It's completely empty, not a single item left. There, there's a bunch of items there. They took everything, didn't they? I've really done something unforgivable. No. If it's my fault, I have to do something about it. At the moment, she saw a familiar shadow in the distance. I found you! Max. What do you want? I have something to talk to you about. Che. What now? What do you even want me to? I'm sorry. Huh? You changed your tune pretty quickly. Everything from yesterday to this morning was entirely my fault. I forget that mopping around at a time like this won't help anything. I see. I'm sorry about earlier. Yeah? This is the only way I know how to live. Don't worry about it. I'm not the kind of dog that can deny that way of life. What? I shall talk to you. You must have been forced to live like that because of me. Because of you? What are you talking about? Let's go to the last current hallway for now. Uh, what do you mean? So what do you want to talk about? You may have heard of him, but do you know what my father? Your father is a drug ring dealer? What the fuck? Is that what it is? Your father? Your last name is... Ehrenberg, you must have heard it on TV at least once. Senator 
Aaron Burr? Yes. My father committed a crime for me. Well, this this ought to be interesting. A crime? Ah. Yeah, you do have a rather weak body and all. As you may have noticed, I was born with a disease. I believe I needed an organ transplant. It wasn't easy to find an organ that matched a young puppy, so my father got involved in a crime. No way. I wish and wish it was a lie. He bought the organs for me from the black market. So, wait, what's the relation with, uh, with Max? But that has nothing to do with me. Yes, it does. He was in a situation where he had to deal with the underworld, and that means someone has something on him. During the transaction with Roku, my father made a contract with a large sum of money. He agreed to help with the drug circulation. <laughs> Yay! Yippee! Woo! Finally! <laughs> some, some revelation. What the fuck is this? I cast many treasures for Max in the Malka. I understand what you're going to say. I'm not so honest I can preach ethics to anyone. You can judge me here and now, in fact, please do. I'm tired of living on, so on someone else's sacrifice. No. I have no right to judge you, let alone judge you for your father's case. But, but... I have one request. Leave. Don't ever think about suicide or something, it would make up for it. That's harsh. My boss often tells me that. By the way, where's JD belongings? It was stored in the cafe, but they've probably disposed of it by now. No way. What? Why? JD said I left what I could leave, and maybe they... But think about it. JD is not that kind of person who wouldn't think of what would happen after she was executed. Anyway, let's go to my boss place. Ah, Fee! E? Hey, what do you have in your hand? Uh-huh. He handed Noel a crumpled paper, piece of paper. To me? He nodded firmly. When Noel opened the paper, she saw what was written there. Silence. Oh, there. Mm hmm By the time you read this, I will... I would likely either have been executed or have died challenging the gods. I'll keep it brief and to the point. In case of any attack, this memo is intended to be secretly placed inside Swiss clothing. Noel's magic is highly efficient because it directly converts soul into magic. There's a solution I want you to use to, to use your magic to connect the scattered fragments of soul across countless spiral words. As you can see from Miles' current condition, soul can maintain their self even if they are incomplete. Yet I need to aim for perfect restoration, find the core of the soul. Yes, may want to interfere with parallel worlds, it shall contain remnants of Seraphim power. If now I use my wand, she can fight the Seraphim more adv advantageously. Although she cannot match the gods, there is hope now that they have vanished for some unknown reason. How the strong image of converging the warm sensation deep within your body from your arm to the tip of the wand. Be cautious of the leader of the soldier, there is something odd about him. Either cover or burn this memo so that no one can read it later. Good luck. Ah, interesting... Interesting way, alright. Chitty? This is what she left behind. I can understand the main part at all. Noel, do you understand? Kinda. Yes, for now. Yeah, let's go back to my boss. At the same time. No matter how far I walk, the scenario doesn't change. Oh. Where am I? My feet are soaked and I feel sticky. At the moment, a black shadow burst out in front of the mocha. What? Ooh, what is that? The shadow gradually took form of dog. Who, who are you? The flickering shadow didn't answer. I feel like I've seen you somewhere before. And the moment shadow slowly pointed in a certain direction. Go off our there? The shadow walked in the direction indicated by the repeated teleportation. <laughs> that's not walking, that's teleporting. Hey, wait. It's gone. 
Now, I have to chase after, after it. <laughs> There's an eater. Switch around. Where am I anyway? There are no artificial objects around. There doesn't seem to be anyone here except for the shadow. I'm not sure, but was there a place like this in the out of town? I might tilt at their head and talk for a moment. No, probably not. Then maybe this is heaven. No, that can be. If it where everyone will be here. Oh. It's strange that there are no angels or gods here either. But it's probably not hell either. Mel said that hell is a scary place. Other start, I was told I was going to hell because I committed a scene. Huh. Then where is this place after all? I want to look at their head and think for a moment. Hmm. I don't know. I should have appeared and pointed in the direction. I remember. I might have seen a place like this on TV. But I think it was a really far away country. I just imagine like... The shadow of the wall just keep pointing in one direction. What the fuck are you doing? Why, why are you reminiscing there? Uh, keep going. Uh huh. So I was sent flying really far away? But why? Why was I sent flying to a far away country? I don't understand why angels of God haven't chased me this far. I remember finding my uncle chasing him, getting pushed away, and then. What happened after that? Oh, I can't remember anything. What shall I do? Shall I chase after the shadow after all? Anyway, I have to move forward. I'm going to decide to go on. Yeah, you passed out after <laughs> after your uncle pushes you. That's so funny. Ah, I might have noticed. Hey, hey, this is a dream. Probably. I probably fainted when my uncle pushed me away. In that case, if I pinch my cheek, I'll definitely wake up. I'm going to pinch cheek as hard as he could. Ow! There was no change in the surrounding scenery. Huh? I'm going to pinch cheek again. Again, there was no change in the scenery. Why? Could it be that this is reality after all? I am tired of walking already. Be patient. I'm still searching. There's nothing. <laughs> Be patient, please. So, quick save. North? East? Suddenly, the lights around Tomoka. Oh, what? What is this? The lights slowly approach at Tomoka. Well, what shall I do? I have to chase the shadow, but... Go through the gap? Like, like that. Go through the gap? I have to run away. Tomoka ran through the light with all their might. However, part of Tomoka D was graced by the light. Ow! I am burning? I am not. I felt really hot just now, but it was my imagination. I have to be careful next time. Ah, the place where the light hurt hurts intensely. It burns, it burns, ow! The next moment, the part grotesquely deform. oh? Ah! Uh. Ah! Uh. Tomoka couldn't bear the pain and crouched down. Ah, uh, when Tomoka realized it, the light was already approaching. Well, that's interesting. The power of creation, huh? Oh my guy's dead. Play again. Yeah, sure. Lie down. If I lie down, will it avoid me? I'm gonna try to lie down and let it go. However, the light can need to approach Shamaka. Eh? Shamaka has set up in light. At the moment, the light was engulfed by a sudden gust of wind. Ah, uh, ah. Uh -huh. What? What just happened? When Amaka looked in the direction of the gust, the shadow was standing there. Okay, why didn't you help back then? <laughs> it, did it just... see me? Oh. The shadow didn't start and start moving again. Oh, wait! Huh, that's interesting. Search around. North? 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 South. Uh, my body feels itchy. When Damaka looked at their body, white grains were clinging to the hand. What is this? Salt, maybe? While Damaka was singing carelessly, the white grains continued to cover the hand. Will they be this is bad? Shake them off, ran away from the spot. Shake. Shake them off? Damaka shook off the white grains clinging to their body. 
I worry the white grains continue to increase as if they were oozing out of their body. But what? Why, 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 why can I get rid of them? Tamaka frantically continued to beat their body. Ouch! Blood was coming out of the spot where Tamaka repeatedly brushed off the grains. What? Who is their blood? I have to wash it in the water so something doesn't soak up. When Tamaka looked back. Ah! Oh, my hand's white. Before they knew it, Tamaka legs were also somehow dyed white and couldn't move. Aren't you already white? Am I, am I confused with something? And then their whole body was dyed white repeatedly. What is this? What's going on? Somebody, somebody! Oh, okay. Hey, help me! Some guy's dead. That's inter interesting, then. Run away from spot? Heck! Then we run out of spot to get rid of them. Haha, <laughs> my tummy. My tummy hurts. Tummy? If I didn't get over quickly, I might really die. Oh. I'm going to take a deep breath, brush off the white grains attached to their body, and left the spot. South? North? There's a lot of them. I'm just gonna keep going until I see something, okay? What the hell is this? Search around. A large rainbow ring floats high in the sky. Wow, it's beautiful! Hey, it's my first time seeing a rainbow ring. When I get back to everyone, I want to tell them about this place. But I don't even know where this place is. It's like a dream world or a fairy tale world. I wonder if heaven was a place as beautiful as this. I can't remember though. I'm gonna look at a rainbow ring and imagine an angel's hello. I was shocked when I was almost killed by an angel or god. Even though cats and the others are servants of orders, I'll be the making contact with the devil instead of angels also. Someone shook their heads to dispel their thoughts that came and went. I have to quickly get back to everyone. Sorry. Okay. Search around again. Watch rainbow rain. Yeah. If there's rainbow, does it rain here? Actually, the ground may be covered in puddles from the rain. I'm gonna crouch down and touch the water mirror on the ground. Huh? It feels sticky. Ugh. What on earth is this water? No guys in the list smell their sticky hand. Mm hmm It doesn't smell like anything. The monkey also lick their hand. It's salty. Will this be salt water? Then is this the sea? But there's no sea in come out of town. Tomoka wondering tilted their head. Interesting. That animal looks like an angel's hello. Angels, huh? Why did God's an angel targets us? They said it was a sin, but I don't understand at all. We need to get into fight after the monster did something terrible in the past. But everyone didn't mean any harm. Ah, but those can get follow by cats until recently. But, but, what if they were really sorry for what they did in the past? And they protected us. Cat follow even if it's like four miles. Oh, and Cat Falog died of old age. It's not good to bring him back to life without permission. And Mars would probably hate that kind of thing. I'm gonna lower their head. Interesting. So, search around again. There's nothing, go north. Oh, this thing. Oh, we are back here, okay. Search around. Several white suns below are lined up. Uh huh. What's this? I'm gonna approach the stone pillar. It feels kind of rough. When I'm gonna touch the white stone pillar, that part crumbled away. What? What, what should I do? Maybe I shouldn't have touch it, touch it. However, nothing else happened. I wonder if there's smell. I'm gonna brought their nose closer, but they couldn't smell anything. Will this also be salt? I shouldn't lick it, right? It's probably really salty. And then... Yeah, I know. I'm sorry, Walt. You just have to stay there. Shall I try licking it a little? I want to a piece of the stone pillar in their hand. But what if it's not salt? Hmm. Hmm. 
the kid. Well, it's probably okay. Probably. I'm gonna crumble the piece and lick it a little. It's salty. I'm gonna look at the white stone pillar with surprise. Is this salt? I think it is. It's not something weird. Just the stomach is about to throw away the salt fragment they had picked up. Ah! What? Well, my hand is white. Ah, okay. It's a bunch of those things. Is that okay then? Don't like it. It's in years after all, so I shall stop, right? I'm gonna throw away the fragment they had picked up and brush off the remaining powder from their hand. Huh? A little blood was seeping from their palm. It doesn't hurt, but did I get myself a little bit of fragment? Come over the wound with a handkerchief. <laughs> yeah, yeah, patient. Why are there salt pillars here? I feel like I've seen a scene like this in an anime before. Like, it was originally dark, but it turned into salt pillar because of a disaster. Then, could it be? This salt pillar was originally a dog or a cat? I want to shut her the thug of animals turning into salt pillars. What, what kind of movie is that? I, do I definitely don't want, don't want to die like that. I shall probably leave here quickly before that happens. <laughs> There's nothing. Okay, how about south? North. North? Ah, east? East. East? Okay, now I'm just following the direction. Oh, almost. <laughs> Wait, this does look different. A faint blue light twinkles in the sky. Oh, a shooting star. It's beautiful. Oh, that's right. I shall make a wish while I have the chance. Someone close their hands and pray to the shooting star. Star instead of God. Please. I hope we can all live in peace again. And that I can have Neko chance, buddy. I must slowly open their eyes. Yeah, that's it. I hope my wish comes true. <laughs> yeah, yeah, be patient. <laughs> I'm doing something here. Huh, the shooting star is still there? It's not going to disappear right away. Could it be that it's not a shooting star? Um, what is it could be called that a dating thing? I remember, a comet. Um, but can I see shooting stars come or comet during the day? I'm gonna talk for a moment. E yes, you can. Well, it's such a mysterious place that anything could happen. At the moment, the comet twinkled. What? what? Huh? What was this just now? Search around. I wonder if everyone can see that comet right now. Or are they still spending time at the station? I wonder if now it's okay. I hope everyone is safe. I'm okay, guess in the comments, I remember the events of that day. There have been a lot of things up to this point. I probably should have died first, but I didn't. I haven't been an, uh, of any use up to this point. I wonder if I'll ever see everyone again. I'm okay, mine was with the face of their beloved. Miles, I want to see you. Okay, so keep going there. What if you don't know where is this? <laughs> you'll, you'll get fucked here. Oh, something new. I'm gonna find something strange in your foot and look down. What? It's sinking. I'm gonna try to leave one foot, but it wouldn't come up as they fell. What shall I do? It won't come out. Struggle? I might as well try to pull out their food. Uh, uh. No, I'm sinking more and more. Before they knew it, Tabakaba they had sunk to their ways. Wait, 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 wait. The more Tabaka you just went up again. Tabaka struggled the more their body sank. Oh my dog, oh my dog, oh my dog, help me! Ah, uh, please, somebody, uh huh. Uh huh, bye bye. Whee! Damn, that step moving us all up in the pale blue ground. Tabaka is dead. Most slowly. Calm down, calm down, you just have to pull my foot out. I have to, I have to take a deep breath first. Inhale, exhale. I'm gonna take a deep breath, put both hands to the ground, and slowly pull one foot out. I did it! I, I have to pull the other one out too. The other foot was pulled off the ground without any trouble. 
I have to get out of here quickly. Um. I'm gonna go down on all fours over seeing Jeffrey again and move away from the spot. Oh. Such round. Wait, what? I should probably hear it quickly. Well, 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 what do you know? It turns out that was west. So this time we have been going east the whole time that was the wrong direction. God fucking damn. Oh, I fucking knew it. Some Something like this will happen. This is spot. I'm tired. Suddenly the shadow stopped teleporting and stood still. Huh? Well, what's wrong? The shadow pointed in the same direction as before. Just a little more. You can talk. The shadow began to move again without saying anything more. I feel like I've heard that voice somewhere before. Oh. So this time, that's east. Okay, at least we know the direction change. Oh, we are getting somewhere. Ah, oh, finally. Oh, I can't walk anymore. When I'm gonna look up, they saw someone lying be beyond her field of vision. Huh? It's those sky blue hair. Sora? I'm gonna run to Sora for getting their fatigue. Hey, are you okay? I'm gonna shook Sora's body, but there was no response. Uh, what should I do? At the moment, Shadow appeared in front of them. S Sora, when I up. The shadow didn't answer but produced a small orange light from what seems to be its palm. The light slowly approached the mocha. Is this? Ah. The mocha gently accepted the orange light which melted into the palm of their hand. At the moment, the sun shining on the horizon began to emit an unusual strong light. What? What is it? The shadow pointed in the direction of the sun. You want me to go there? When Tomoka looked back, the shadow had already disappeared. What? what? Hey, hey, where exactly? No response. I haven't, I haven't even thanked you yet. Oh, Tomoka picked up Sora and slowly began to walk towards the sun. Uh, what the hell? You just appeared out of nowhere. Sora? Uh, no, I was sorry for worrying you. It's completely covered, as you can see. I'm glad. It looks like you made up well with her too, Max. Shut up, stop making that face, boss. Well then, shall we go outside and get some fresh air? Huh? What are you talking about, Charlie? Come on, let's go. Charlie took Max and the others out of the platform. As she left, Charlie being in a mouth at something Noel and the others. Take your time! He... He misunderstood something about us, right? Yeah. When I arrived here, I met JD. She was alive. Yes, until a little while ago. I see. Sarah began to mutter with depressed expression. In the end, I couldn't do anything until I got here. Saner. Windy. Cornerstone members. Miles. Emma. They sacrificed their lives one after another and... I couldn't stop them. Everyone trusted me with it, but in the end I failed. I should have been able to overturn the rules of the world. I can't even handle my own power properly and for someone like me, everyone just did that. Sora. No, gently hug Sora. It's okay, I'm sure I'll be okay. Oh, that's sweet. Dun, 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 I got trapped in the limbo for so long. That's what everyone wanted, I'm sure. Our problem is something we have to face ourselves, but this battle is too heavy for you to bear alone. But, but. That's right, Sora. Oh. oh Tamaka? Did she regain consciousness? Everyone cares about you, Sora. That's why we want to help you. You sure don't think you have to do it alone. We're friends, right? I. I'm a fool who can even save my partner. Because of my weakness, he's still there. Huh? Oh, interesting. At that moment, something flashed through Sora's head, causing him intense pain. 
Yeah. Sora. Sora pushed Noel and the others aside and crouched down. Ugh. Ah. Are you okay? Who, who is this? What is this? Sora began to emit a pale blue mist from his body. Er, uh, eh, eh, what is this? What on earth is this? Wait, I'll call Sophie. Or a more Rory cut through the shelter. What, what? The presence of an angel? Could it be that they sense there's something that Sora is emitting? Are you okay? Ma Max! Yes, now. Again? Shit, why now? We shall live here now. Now they are still running through the hallway at full speed. I can't take this anymore. It's it's split it. Next is right after turning left. Now hear a noise from the left. Uh I should trust Charlie more. After seeking the way out, they get into that end. I need to escape. No. It's too late. Before they knew it, no letters were surrounded. Damn it, can't believe it ended like this. Oh, Noel and the others were caught by the angels. Noel and the others are exhausted. Left? Noel and the others turn left. Uh huh. An ambush? Shit, I give up. This is the end. Damn it. I'm sorry, I can no longer fulfill it. Now the rest were covered with angels again. Awesome. Right? No, the rest are right. Dear Jim, look back. Eh? The number of angels is increasing. This, it seems like Left West was ambushed. But this was a detour. It's better than dying. Ha uh, ha, let's hurry. Another corner! Charlie! It's okay, I don't hear any noise. Noel. Roger. Uh huh. That end again. I've seen the way out, they get into that end. Noel, hurry, two paths. Only one path will lead to survival. You're asking for the impossible. Max up in fear into the right path. Hurry! R Roger! Oh, splitting up. Ah! This is a shutter! We've been tricked. They just got away with us. This is the end for us. Mm hmm, interesting. Then left will be the shutter area, right? Ah! What? The shutter is closed? We've been tricked. Interesting, let's go back. So right this time? No, the rest are right. Y yes, there are no angels here. When Sophie looked back, she saw that the other path was blocked by shutter. The left path, the shutter is closed. We almost get caught. We have to be careful about everything. Damn, damn it's so hard. We can just stand here and talk. Anyway, let's turn right again and go back to the first fork in the road. Huh? What the? Shutter is here too? Yeah, me, they're catching up with us. It's now or ever. Let's turn to Angel's hand. Go through the side up or down. Noel, are you out of your mind? She's shaking her head reluctantly. We can die like this. Let's do it. That's right. Let's follow Noel's lead. It's better than being killed. We have no choice. I yes we we have done it once before. That's right, Tamaka. We've succeeded once, we can do it again. They are here. Quick save. What are you doing, Noel? If they get any closer we can avoid them. No. Go through the bottom. Roger. A snow dog at her one, everyone runs for the angels. Jump! With that shout shot Noel and the other jump the angels bosom, and they slip through the angels like a slide. Alright, we made it. Alright, we made it. Oh, however, no one there accidentally called it with a large piece of the bracelet that was rolling on the ground. I can't. 
Huff, is everyone okay? P, get a hold of yourself. No, she knocked out. While they were struggling, they were surrounded by angels. Damn, we're out of luck. But what's going on? Is the end. Interesting. So, if we go through the bottom, that will happen, right? Ah, okay. It automatically picks to the bottom. Jump over. Jump over to the top. Roger. As I to get her one, everyone ran towards the angels. Jump! We had shown on there's jump near the ceiling. Wow! And they jump over angels' heads and land on their side. Let's go! Let's go back to the foreign road and head to the exit. I hope we can shake them off by then. We can't shake them off at all. What happened? This seems to know our location, huh? We will we'll chase if we go outside right now. Sure. We have no choice. Max will stop and turn to the angels. You have a gun all this time? Max? Go quickly, this is my hand. Understood. Charlie? That's a reckless. That's what he decided. Stop lagging, talking and go quickly. I'll address to you. Go, Noel. Okay. I love, I love how Charlie dragged everyone there. That's so cool. Charlie dragged everyone away. I can't believe it ended like this. The angels are closing in. Just fire your gun already. You came, you fuckers. Didn't save us before and call yourself angels, huh? Too bad nobody will pass me today. Max revealed inside of his coat and what inside is bomb. A lot of grenades. Granadas? I'm your fucking Grim Reaper. Red of red, a flash of light, and blast of fire for the, the tunnel. Oh yeah, getting out of style. Getting out of style. No, no, Al. Huh, huh. Hang there, just a little bit more. Okay, there's the stair door outside. We can finally get out. At the moment, an explosion sounded from behind. Who hold it be, Max? Get out, no, my head, the ceiling is collapsing. When all enders get down, the ceiling of the corridor collapses. The corridor is blocked by the rubble. Will it be that he blocked the angels with a mountain of rubble? Let's go. Hearing all as well as everyone ran to see if they were shot out. Max, you are such a cool boy. Phew! We finally got out, but we can let our guard down. That's right, we have to take actions before they come over the rubble. Uh -huh, but the next move we can make is... What's wrong, Fee? When Fee pointed up, we could see that the sky was covered by something dark and huge. Oh, what's that? Will it be a new enemy? We already busy enough. Fee, hide behind me. Fee, hide behind Charlie as she was tall. Oh, interesting. That's ridiculous. No way. Did she notice something? Holy be. Those are all... Angels. Oh. Well, there's nothing we can do about that. Oh, we've come this far. Don't give up, Damaka, we're still alive. I'm sorry, Damaka. Eh? If I reach my limit with just this one shot, let's take care of the rest. No. Noel? No, I'll take JD's one out of her pocket. Uh, that's for when God attack us again. No, you, you, uh, wait, you actually don't read the note, but yeah, the note says that it's for Noel to at least face the Seraphim in a full threat. If you die here, it's all over. No, I'll hold the one with both hands to bring posture. JD, please lend me your power. Then she gripped the one with her right hand and swung it up with all her might. Hell yeah. What incredible power! This is the power of hope left by the witch. It's amazing! Uh, amazing, Noel. With one shot, you might defeat a large group of angels. Huff, huff. Noel then kneeled down the spot. Uh, are you okay? Y yes, I'm just a little tired. Here, I'll lend you my shoulder. Uh, thank you. Oh, what's wrong, Fee? 
Bravo, bravo. I can't believe you escaped on your own and defeated the troublesome angels. You are... Where the hell were you? Do you even realize how many of our friends died because you didn't work properly? Stop it, Sophie. How brave of you showed us safe and sound. I think you were eaten. The military walked to Noel without care. Hello, Noel Arnberg. You look tired. Good job. What do you want? Oh, what a harsh girl. I came to praise a good citizen who did well. He said and put his hand on Noel's shoulder. Ah, huh, blue light. Interesting. Hell yeah, Noel. <laughs> oh. I knew it. Eh? Get down. Is that magic coming out of your hand? Everyone hide behind me. Everyone except Noel hide behind Charlie immediately. When did you notice? I first felt something was wrong when I first met you. Jenny was injured so badly that she couldn't fully realize that discomfort. That is from the presence of another angel. When I expect escaped the cabin, I soon told me something weird. Told me that I was killed by an angel disguised as a survivor. There are many other hints. Oh, that's an interesting callback, actually. The fact that you already know my full name. The lack of self-awareness of the soldiers. And the fact that the angels found a shelter. And what really convinced me was... When you said, Our Creator. Those words were spoken by Seraphim and the Creator. I see, there's a reason why the two pillars of Christians are worried. As he said that his body was wrapped in dazzling light. Aha! Uh -huh. You're topless! Congratulations, Noel Arnberg, Seraphim. You are correct. The Seraphim suddenly fired a light bullet. Okay. Now let's do the Dutch light bullet. Everyone hide in there and stop the station. Roger. Noel, you'll definitely win. Of course. Now she didn't rest Jedi once the sky. Light of her flowed from Noel's body and gathered in the wand. Oh, 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 that's an interesting design. And now also her body was wrapped in emerald particles and butterfly wings. Now, let's begin. It's a feudal struggle. The two flew into the sky at the same time. Because I'm making it for so called Thailand. Then I presume you can intimidate us. With that, Seraphim summoned countless meteors to rain down. Are there any meteors one more than me? Now it's a little different the meteors coming her way. Oh, do you truly believe that as long as you're safe, nothing else matters? Several meters are hidden in the fall towards the and the others. Watch out! Uh huh. This is bad. Meteors are coming this way too. Everyone hide behind me. No one have done in interposed itself between meters and the Mokka and the others. Everyone get down. No, no, Elle. Destroy the Madrid. What shall I do to minimize the damage? No, I'll hurry! No, it's the one with full power and crush the meter down at once. We did it! This is bad. How are the falling debris hit now directly? Uh No, are you okay? I'm okay. So, Emma Light got her nose body and healed her wounds. Noah swung her one and Lord Shonerlo and Philip Tomok and the others. We should keep you safe for a while. I'll be back soon. No, well. Make sure you win. Yes, I win. Interesting, so that can happen. Let's go back. Okay, defend with a barrier. Now the barrier to protect them against the others. Is everyone okay? Yes, somehow. Even for an angel, this thing has is quite the outright tactic. That's not fair, right now, Noel doesn't have time. Awaka, please don't say that. I am sorry. Okay, this is coming there. Now I can use the fire light balls from her wings and float towards the Seraphine. How annoying. Now it's our turn. Charge forward. Now I'm bit her one mid magic and strong. 
Do there's chance to be in close combat with your makeshift skills? How amusing. So every million the Dutch chance to be a Noel. I think you do that. Now Dutch just surprise attack from behind. What? what? And then she hit the Seraphim with a light ball. Imagine if the Seraphim just like said, I thought you did it as well and teleported back and they just continuously teleported back to each other. Yeah. It's far from over. How bothersome. The Seraphim gathered terrifying magic into their palm and scattered it round. That's the new magic. Then it reacted with the atmosphere and caused a serious mass massive explosion. Even barrier. Now deploy the barrier to protect herself from the explosion. The explosion subsided and now there is barrier. Seraphim is gone? How naive, Noel Ehrenberg. No, it's behind. At the moment, a barrier was accidentally deployed and blocked the Seraphim's surprise attack. What? Will this be JD's doing? No, I'll take advantage of the winning and hit Seraphim with a light ball. A parting gift from JD Green. How endlessly bothersome. But no matter, I've got my own plans. As the swarm muttered, a huge eerie cloud light ball from the ball from sky. What the hell is that? Uh, ah! That's the same thing that Seraphim we first met use. Oh my god, do you know about this? Yeah, Sora and Windy, we, we're already feeling the heat just by getting close to it. What happens if we get hit by it? I think we die, probably. That's a freaking huge problem. I think if you get hit by anything here, you die, so yeah. <laughs> but however that is, all we can do is watch. That is... Will that be the, the same thing that blue hair Seraphim use? Don't compare me with that technique to the one you met before. With that, the Seraphim compressed the light ball and instantly held it in both hands. Eh? And the magic in both hands continued to grow. It's starting to get weird. Eh, what? What's that? Oh, Chan, did you know about this? I... I don't know about this. I just... it just fell down at a time. Oh, I can send them again the others who are behind and blow her. No, I can avoid this. Yeah, it's a... Concentrated magic attack, apparently, which is interesting. With a single blow, I shall erase this planet. No, this entire universe along with you. Understood. I'll take it. Take this, a striking beat with the very presence of the very essence of the universe. Here it comes. And then a fierce beam of light was released from the seraphim hands. Even with barrier, push back with magic. No, I cannot buy firing beam from her wand. Yeah! Sophie and the others were desperately clinging to Charlie's body. Everyone did not go of your strength. Even now, it's magic is protecting us. No, well, you're the only one we can rely on now. Yeah! No, can you to rain light bullets on the seraphim? Do you think that it will work against me? How strange, she may think she's being clever, but... She deliberately missing their magic trajectory by about 20%, no, perhaps even lower. What is she planning? Are you planning a Vegeta thing? Wait, was it Vegeta or someone? Ah! I've always been safe by you all. Every time, every single time. I envy you for standing shoulder to shoulder with that person. I cherish that person who always protected me. But more than that, I really, really wanted to see you to standing shoulder to shoulder in my view forever. Now it's my turn. Hell yeah. You go. Go forward, Noel. To protect you and that person. It's time to repay the favor. I'll cross in to serve him with the speed of light and swing her wind down. Foolish, do you think you can match me in power? Why did she pretend to see everyone like that? While you are in the military, did she not learn anything? What a ridiculous question. Why should I care about the hearts of my servants? Altering their memories and infiltrating them was a child's play. The seraphim created a spear with her free hand and shot it. Mow down. No, mow down the spear with her wand. You've fallen for it. Ouch, let's go back then. 
Ouch. No, I can't do that just by seeing her body. Now what can you do to send her self qualifying light boots of surfing? There are soldiers who followed you. They followed you because they believe in you. Did you also treat them as pawns? That was merely a fragment of a cell. It never had a will of its own. The seraphim charged with a fierce magical power. You went that far just to see fast. Defend with a barrier again? Now can you deploy the barrier? Do you think you can block this? The barrier intercepted the seraphim charge. However, the barrier cracked and shattered in an instant. Why are you green? Be blown away. Oh, that's hurt. Dodge? Not quickly dodge. I won't be hit by the attack. Is that so? Ah! The seraphim suddenly curve and charge straight into the north side. I'll take a direct hit from the seraphim charge side, both. So both deal damage, huh? I think it's part of the plot point here. Now it needs to take damage. But I'll take damage of the and port magic that controlled life into the seraphim. Gah! Yeah. Oh, sorry. Did I skip that? No, I didn't. Yeah. Uh, you must be at your limit by now. How dare you? I'll wipe everything out with this. The serpent with their body with magic and was about to self destruct. I have to stop it. Punch right away, cast, ma cast magic, yeah. I won't let you. Now carry the huge magical fort against where the seraphim. Do you think you can defend yourself with such feeble efforts? In an instant, surroundings were enveloped in a dazzling flash of light. And when the lights subsided, nothing was left. Oh, no, this is us. We, we lost? Okay. Punch right away. Now I charge with magic just like the Seraphim did earlier. You, have you been learning from my attacks? No, you just have openings left with this. I won't let you self distract. Now I'll definitely Seraphim Blossom and stuck her with her wand, putting all her wits into it. What? Look, now it's, look, look, now it's pushing it. Y yes, I see it. Fee, Fee was waving her hands, cheering. No, you can do this. You're going to save the world. You, you fool! I myself was given a greater mission from the Creator. You cannot lose to a dog-like creature. The seraphim wrote and fired a light ball in anger. Stop it already! Now I shut and disperse the light bulb with a swing of the wand. Seraphim, there's one reason for your defeat. Now I rest the wand to the sky and created a huge particle of light. Me? No. Us. You underestimated us animals. This is the end. And the vertex of light attacked the Seraphim. It won't be that easy. Uh, do you run out of power or what? Or did someone interfere? Ah, uh, yeah, I've already returned apparently. Shit. Ah. Uh, the god of order. Well, we are so fucked. You are regenerated faster than the other person. Uh huh. No, Emma. <laughs> it took a while to eliminate that blood demon. But your advance ends here. No way. That's God? He's not a different from us, is he? Then he glanced at Seraphim was cornered and tattered. What's with that pathetic state? I sincerely apologize. You shall step back. But, I ordered you to step back. Understood. The Seraphim wrapped his body in his own wings and disappeared in an instant. Now, Noel Ironbird. You took a very roundabout way. Your goal is to repair his soul, is not it? 
I take your son's as yes. I see indeed. Had it been that the seraph who stood before you moments ago? Well, you could have done it with ease, even if you had doubts. However, did you truly believe I would have no countermeasures in place? The core of the soul, the core fragment that forms the ego, your plans lack that. It is sealed in a place where no one can reach, where no one can notice. Only Tomoka can reach it, right? Or Sora. Because Tomoka has that power. Now, shall I give you a little punishment? This place is... In front of Sora, I saw a familiar landscape spread out. You've got guts, Sora. It's not about whether you're strong or weak, it's about whether you have guts. Alright, from now on, you're my buddy. Shut up, rules for breaking. We're already in the same boat. I'm sorry I suddenly gone all by myself. But you know what they say, if you want to fool your enemy, you have to start with your allies. Doesn't matter, you've been the only one since the beginning, right? Glutinous, sincere, and caring. Bye, buddy. No one hasn't changed since we first met. Anyone change? Uh, change always. Now go save the world, buddy. Of course, buddy. I see everything was. Uh -huh, I completely forgot just like my buddy back then. What should I say when it's all over? Yeah. Soda. Windy. You are safe. I'm glad. No, probably not. Oh, I'm sorry. I had no luck. <laughs> I see, I'm sorry. Don't worry, I choose this path myself, but you have to fails. Please give him my regards. Now you have your mouth, tell him yourself. I won't let you, let everyone end up dead like this. I see. Well, I'm waiting and I won't expect too much, Sora. Yeah, just wait a little longer, I'll... I'll get everything back. What? What? Oh, I can watch this. Charlie and me are gone. Nope, we cannot do shit. But see? See what? We can even be a dog shield for her. What should we do? No, Noel. Yeah. Oh. You are barely holding on by your everything the power of Seraphim Marnin are not you. It is outstanding to grow this much in such a short period. I should have eliminated you, eliminated you earlier. You, why, gods, tell me. How can you make such a cruel judgment? If what we did in the past in the former world is a sin, then you shall only judge us. Why do you involve innocent people? This is not just your problem, Noel Arnberg. You must have heard it from JD Green, right? It is the result of the accomplishment that started from distant past. It's unfair. You wasted enough time. Your body is already reaching its limit. What are you saying? You can still fight. In a moment, the one slipped through Ronald's sand and rolled to the ground. Uh huh. It seems that even maintaining your existence is harsh for you. Uh, why am I already out of magic? It is the great principle, if you keep blocking the power of the creator god, it is natural. This is the end. Zenith aim his palm at no end of light. Ah, Sora. No! B! Did you see- what? When Charlie looked back, he was gone. Sora? The dust was blown away and suddenly what appeared from there was... <laughs> Hell yeah. Hell yeah, Sora. Here it comes. Sora. Noel, sorry I'm late. Thank you for holding on this long, I made it in time thanks to you. Sora made a light, a light blue light from his palm and healed Noel wounds. Ah. Uh. At the same time, a faint light fell from the sky. What is this light? It's warm, like the sun. You feel your talk? 
It's warm, like the sun. P? You can talk now? Eh? What? So this is the power of the Son of God. While I was in unbearable pain, I heard a very familiar, familiar voice. I was the biggest fool in the world, much more than him. You remember him, didn't you? Yeah, I remember. You remember too, you Noel. Know? Yes, thanks to Power Life with JD. Sir Hug Noel. I couldn't bring him back. It's frustrating, but I can only trust you to bring him back, Sora. I can bring him back. I must get Sora hands with all her might. Please. 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 For this world and everyone. Due to the excessive fatigue by caused by the excessive use of power and all this consciousness. And uh, now you need to rest peacefully. No, well, I'll take care of. I'll take over the rest. Leave it to me. To be continued. Chapter. Oh, hell yeah, the glitch. Let's go. Interesting. Very interesting. So, is next chapter to Mocha? I wonder if next chapter is Tomoka. And something like that. And Sora. Either way, wow, okay. This one is actually quite interesting. I, I really love the no other characters here. It's it's interesting. It finally paints out who Noel's parent is and what did they do. And how Noel finally it, it it's fulfilling. It feels fulfilling because Noel repays kinda quote unquote replace everything that has been in her mind for the whole time, which is amazing. I love that. The fight with the uh, Seraphim is great as always. And Sora turning back to stop Zenith. That's so that's amazing. That's awesome. <laughs> I still don't know why the light bullet missed by 20% though. Also, uh what else? Yeah, the Zenith returning is also cool as fuck. But other than that, that's all I got to say for Perfect Apocalypse. It's still imperfect for the beer. Still nice with all the Perfect Apocalypse design. I love it. It's just hilarious sometimes because it, <laughs> there's mention like drugs like <laughs> in Perfect Apocalypse, which is silly because of the art and stuff like that. But yeah, I have nothing else to say. Either way, that's all for Perfect Apocalypse. In, uh, Pia, sorry, Perfect Apocalypse if Universe imperfect for the beer. I hope you enjoy it. See you later then. In the next chapter, probably, or in my next video. Bye bye.